Hello whiskey lovers and welcome to another one of Mark's whiskey ramblings and today we will try the Royal Salute. Now Royal Salute, 21 years old, that was created at the time many 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 years ago uh, uh, to celebrate the coronation of Queen Elizabeth II and it is a reference to the ceremonial cannon shots that were fired from the Tower of London. Now over the years many versions of the Royal Salute, 21 years old, have appeared but this is a very special one. This is the Royal Salute, 21 years old, the peated blend. The peated blend, well, that already tells us something, of course. But the, the master blender, Sandy Hislop, for this special edition, the peated blend, he also used molds that are no longer being produced. I'll have you know that the fingerprint molds in this Royal Salute 21 years old, the peated blend, are Imperial, closed, and peated Capedonic, closed. Wow. So I'm quite excited uh, to give this one a try. Uh, oh, there's a lot of wind all of a sudden. Bear with me. Um, my friend John from Virginia, he comes over once in a while, and whenever he comes over, he brings along a bottle. I think we've started a very good tradition there, John, so please keep doing that. In the meantime, thank you, John. We'll give this the Peter Blend a try. It is um, uh, a bottle that 40% ABV. And it's got this beautiful coppery color, as you can see. Yep, that's coppery, all right. So I do believe there is some sherry cask matured whiskey in the mix as well. So imperial, peated capodonic, and all sorts of malts and grains in there as well. It is a blend of all ingredients are at least 21 years old. Right, let's give this one a go on the nose. Wow. Wow, in one word, complex. It's fruity sweet. I get some caramel and oranges, some apple sauce, some candied apricots in there. A touch mineral as well. It reminds me of a cognac for a moment there. A very good cognac. <laughs> a dash of wood smoke in there as well. And a particularly delicate touch of peat all the way in the background. But this is very good. Wow. Oh, I can, I can nose this for a very long time. But moving on, delicious nose on the palate. Mm. This is velvety soft with a, a slight metallic hint in there before the fruit basket all of a sudden seems to explode on your palate. Wow, all kinds of oranges, uh, citrus fruits in the lead, followed by apricots, some mango now, peach, baked apples, there's a lot going on here, but all of that fruitiness, all of that goodness is wrapped in this delicate smoky blanket, this delicately peaty blanket that gives a, a beautiful warmth in the mouth as well. Well, this is elegant and robust at the very same time, and it is absolutely amazing on the finish. Nice, very long, a bit spicy, a bit warm, gently drying, but so elegant, so satisfying. Wow, this is, this is a masterpiece. I have to say, I've had a couple of the regular Royal Salute 21 years old, and I, well, it, it was okay, it was a very good blend, but this is... This is something else. This is a special edition. This is a very special edition. This, the peated blend. And to be honest, this kind of, yeah, it sounds, it smells, it tastes like this is the answer by Shivers Brothers to the, 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 the Ghost and Rare series of Johnny Walker Blue. This is the Shivers Brothers answer to that. And it, 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 it holds its own. It's an absolutely masterpiece love it john thank you so much for bringing this bottle whenever you come I'll, I'll leave some i'll leave some so when you come back soon please come back we'll give it another go because this is an absolutely stunning whiskey and that's all for this whiskey rambling the uh, the royal salute 21 years old the peated blend with imperial and peated capodonic 
an absolute masterpiece. That's all for this Whiskey Rambling, and I hope to see you at one of Mark's Whiskey Ramblings real soon. And until then, may the malt be with you. Bye-bye.